following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from the nearest nightclub, L. Buster O. Wow, listen to that reaction. approaching the ring from El Salvador, the shadow. Oh, I am ready for this. Hello from my name is Yellow and welcome to my second ever league match and this is it El Bustero versus Tigre, well Panadero Tigre um, for the week I guess and I know what you'll all be thinking why is Buster Gate wearing a mask and just what is going on here why why did you skip a week last week also well what happened is um, this is it. This is the semi-final matchup for the World Heavyweight Championship Tournament. The winner will move on to be in the World Heavyweight Championship match at the very first pay-per-view United Champions next week. And the loser will be involved in a Intercontinental Championship match at the pay-per-view next week also. So either way, uh, someone is getting a title shot. Well, both men are getting a title shot here. But which one? It all gets decided in this match. Now, after last week... Uh, after the first week, I guess, where Buster Gates picked up the win for his tag team, um, which his tag team partner was Panadero, which is who he is facing in this match, Buster went over to Mexico to um, to learn some uh, high flying moves. He met up with Tigre uh, Juro, who was Panadero's original trainer, and basically he beat him up. He beat him up and. Uh, he bought his own mask and said that he was going to be known as El Bustero. El Bustero for the week. And what happened was Panadero did not show up for the match. He did not show up for the match. He has disappeared. No one knew where he was. And then uh, Buster got a little annoyed after he missed his match last week. And he, he sort of went on a rant. He drank a lot of champagne. And he was like, you know what? No, I'm giving him another chance. I'm giving him another chance. I didn't waste all my money buying this stupid mask for no reason. I'm going to use this mask, whether you like it or not, Panadero. So I'm giving you one more chance. Come out of the ring this week and face me another chance at the World Area Championship. And now here we are. Here we are. Panadero has appeared for the match. He has returned. No one knows where he was. But he is back. And now this is it. El Bustero versus Panadero. Uh, the match that should have happened last week but didn't. It is now happening this week. So who is going to come out on top? The big man, Buster Gates? Or the smaller man, Panadero? Who knows? Who knows? Well, I know. I played the match already. But you guys don't know who are watching this right now. So it's going to stay in suspense right now. I would say it's pretty even. Panadero has got in one or two extra moves, but apart from that, we are both good. We both still have a lot of stamina. We both have um, a lot of health left. And the reversals are very easy online, especially in 1v1 matches um, where there isn't any connection problems at all. Uh, I've never come up with any connection problems online yet. And I hope to continue that way forever. Forever. The servers are a lot better this year, it seems. Um, so, yes, there's a big suplex by Albus Duro. He... <laughs> 
He wanted to be known as that for the week. He wanted, he just wanted to learn how to do a, hur a hurricanrana, hurricane rana. So will he hit a hurricanrana in this match? Who knows? But Panadero, the first one to gain some uh, damage there. Bust, Buster Gates with the drop kick connect, and now Buster taunting it up. He's looking good. He's in good shape right now. Slamming Panadero, mask first into the mask, and oh, there's a reversal. There's a. Uh, Hurricanrana of Panadero Zone. And Buster backing up now. He doesn't know what to do. He tries to run at uh, Buster. That doesn't work. He gets Fireman slammed for his efforts. And Buster now back on top. He has done more damage. He has a signature move. Oh, and there's a reversal Irish whip into the, the uh, ropes. Another one. And that's the reversal. There's the reversal. Buster getting back on the offense now. Oh, there's the slab reversal into a punch to the head of Buster. And there's the leg sweep that misses. And Buster trying to go for the grab, gets reversed and thrown over the top rope. And then, oh, there's another reversal, punch to the face. And Buster now just getting back into the ring. What can he do though? What can he do? He gets reversed again and thrown to the outside of the ring. And again, that time he actually got hit and fell out of the ring. He fell out of the ring. So again, both men evenly matched right now. Buster has slightly better health and slightly more momentum. But it's been an even match so far. There's still no one who's capable of taking the lead by a lot right now because both men are so evenly matched this way into the match. So Buster first one back into the ring, he runs at him, tries to grab him, misses, but that second time he does grab him and just throws him behind him, throws him behind him, throws him across the ring. And Buster now trying to stomp down, gets reversed again. And another running Hurricanrana connects and Buster taking some damage now and, and Panadero taunting back to Buster. But yes, both men have a signature and Buster Oh, elbow to the back of the head. And now what's he going to do? He goes for his finish. It gets reversed. And Panadero is in a great spot right now. He has a signature. He has a finisher. I knew he was trying to hit one. So just try and punch him uh, while he while he wasn't paying attention as much. Trying to hit his finisher or signature or something. And now, oh, there's another reversal by Panadero. And again, the reversals back and forth. I knew at this point I was in a bad position. I had no, um, no momentum. My stamina was pretty low at this point he has a signature and a finisher and right there he hits his signature and I was like oh god no this isn't good I still had more damage than him he jumps to the outside takes me out I was not expecting that and he is looking great right now he has two finishers and yeah I was just like oh god this is it it's over I used that finisher at the wrong time I used the finisher at the wrong time I knew it so I rolled back into the ring I still gotta try and take him down I miss with the grab he grabs me and then he gets me up and who the strength of Panadero taking me down and I use my comeback and he grabs me he goes straight for his finisher <laughs> I was not ready for it but he hits a finish off that he hits a finish of me doing my comeback gets me up and oh my god on my back and I'm like oh that's it it's over but no he climbs to the top ropes he climbs and here he goes, the moonsault time, he's up and moonsault connects and that's it, there was no way I was kicking out of that, so Panadero wins, he moves on to the World Heavyweight Championship match, I move on to the Intercontinental Championship match, hope you enjoyed this video, if you did please like it up, subscribe if you haven't already, and other than that, I will see you next time.